All right, race fans, we are back at the coin pusher for another coin pusher race, but one like none other. Thanks to a suggestion from CCS, we are running a beauty pageant. Here they are. This coin pusher. What everyone's been waiting for all week. Hope you got your prediction in. If you didn't get it in by now, you are out of luck. Okay, we've got Cindy Brady all the way on the left in yellow. Uhara, Angry Mom, a Sanderson sister, Ruth Buzzy, and Catwoman. Now, I always play across all the way. I don't have... Uh, I don't have a dog in the fight, which I don't want to say Whoa. that because um, it's a beauty patch. <laughs> Did you think horse first and then switch to dog, or were you thinking dog the whole time? I was thinking dog, but oh my goodness, they're not dogs. None of these ladies are dogs. In fact, Catwoman is definitely not a dog. Go ahead, play cross, John. Be you don't have a favored, favored. Uh, Winner in this in this particular competition, we're just playing all I right. I try left. to be as even-handed as I can be. Now, yeah. typically in a beauty pageant, there are different rounds, or do they call it it's rounds, phases, category. they get points. categories? Yes. They get points for different categories. The swimsuit competition, the evening gown competition, talent competition, whatever. Well, you know, if one of the competitions was number of coin pusher videos started, I think oh, Angry Mom would win that. That would be down. Angry Mom. She has been in a boatload of coin pusher oh, videos. Oh, Cindy Brady is moving forward. I don't think she's got a young. Oh, the whole structure is. Angry Mom is pushing that Sanderson sister ahead. And I keep forgetting the name of that Sanderson sister. So is that Winifred? I, 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 you're right. I think it's I think it's Winnie. Our our viewers out there will definitely correct us. But I think Winnie and the Sanderson sisters have been in an awful large why. number of videos, so they would probably be second place in that category. But then I don't know who it would be. I don't know if it'd be Cindy or Catwoman. I don't know. They surprisingly have actually crossed over in videos. Oh, Cindy Brady is moving ahead. Not what she wants to do, folks. Remember, you're rooting for the last, the last game piece left in the machine. And of course, Uhara and Ruth Fuzzy. Unfortunately, they would be tied for last place in this category because this is their debut video. Has Uhara not been in one? This is Uhara's debut video. Ooh. So she finally gets a tick for that passion, so none of them would be disqualified because, hey, this is their first video, and if you include the promo, this is technically their second video. True, true, true. true. The promo is itself a short video, so booyah, booyah. Hmm. John's doing very nicely at being even. I like to treat my ladies with an even feel. Daddy doesn't play favorites. No, 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 no. With the harem ladies, you've never played favorites. That's oh, just a... Oh. That would be a disaster. That would not be good. Okay. Now, I'm trying to think of what some other some other coin pusher pageant categories might be. Uh, besides most number of videos, if we were doing... Uh, let's see. Dollar value of coins required to push them out or something? I don't know. Well, so another category could be number of times in which they played the villain in a video. Ooh. See, I wouldn't classify Angry Mom's character ever as the villain. She's the stopper frequently. She's, she but is, not she's the victim a lot of times. She is, and she is, so she wouldn't actually count. So it, I think it would be Winnie. Who would come in as a Sanderson sister? I don't know. I don't know because she wasn't everything she was in. She was not the bad guy. Well, there's there were the Roger the Pirate episodes where 
Yeah, would you? She was being chased by the sister. I guess that's not being a villain. There was the they original Hocus Pocus video where they kind of were the villain. Yes. So there's one. Catwoman. But, I don't know, Cindy Brady could actually top that one, because Cindy Brady, she's, the bad she's guy. been the bad guy, That's and nice. has appeared by name in multiple videos as... As herself. As herself. Yes. Whereas the Sanderson sisters um, are sometimes stepsisters to the princess. So, hmm. hmm. We have to separate the player from the role, you know. All right, now another coin pusher in pageant category could be greatest hairdo. Oh, oh. that's going to be a tough one. You got Cindy oh, Brady you got up in Cindy braids. And you got Lee. I don't know. You got Uhara with her hair up. Yes. You've got those lovely. I don't know what you call them on Winnie. Um. Poofy things. Poofy things. Uh, mouse ears. I don't know. They're like buns, but on the side. Catwoman's hair looks like it's down for business. And yes. Ruth Buzzy's character looks like she's busy at work. She's wearing a hair net. Yeah. As a lunch lady. She's just keeping her hair out of everyone's every time. So far, none of the pieces have any in the no, none of them. Angry Mom looks like she's going to fall off of her tower. She was pushing Winifred early. Ooh, Ruth Buzzy just moved ahead. And Angry Mom looks like she's got a practical bob that's quick to rinse off and dry so she can go yell at more kids. It's actually, it's a style that unfortunately nowadays would be called carry hair. I know some Karens and I love those people. So I'm not sure who would take first place in the hairdo category. I, by the way, when I say that someone's pulling ahead, really they're falling behind because this is backwards. It is. I think if I was to measure whose hair took the longest. Well, Cindy Brady, that takes some time to do. I, I think O'Hara's hair might take a while in terms of maintenance. And yeah, it takes time to put your hair up like And if that woman has a great hair, hair, that could take a while. I don't know. Now, when I was a little girl, my hair was kind of Cindy Brady-ish. I had the pigtails on the sides. Not blonde, kind of red. Um, I would never want one of these Who wants mouse ears? Okay, it looks like Cindy Brady might fall off of her tower. It might be. She's leaning inwards. Okay, playing all the way across. Still trying to play evenly everywhere because I, I don't have a favorite lady other than the one behind me right now. Oh, there oh, she Cindy. goes. Wow, she almost fell out the owner's return slot. Oh my gosh, that would be a that would be a record. We've never had a game piece go out the owner's return slot. Yeah, you're going to have to catch those up. Oh, 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 oh. oh. She saw Sydney Brady making a break for it and said, well, I'm not going to be the last one in here. But, oh, I did troll hole trigger. So, do I get an extra turn? You get an extra turn. I and our live turn. streams, oh, no. no our live, live streamers are going to be so upset. They'll never know. <laughs> okay, so we keep playing. And Angry Mom and Winnie are on the right. And her hopped out of there. She's totally out of there. There is no hope of O'Hara returning to the play field. What Remarkably, shame. Catwoman and Ruth Buzzy are still chilling out on their towers. Now, I wish I had Catwoman's figure, but O'Hara has got some awesome hair. She does. Um, Angry Mom, she's got that can-do kind of attitude. She's She doesn't take any guff off of anybody. No guff. No guff oh, Now, 
the Ruth Buzzy character, I have had a tendency to have her short temper. So happy now? Yes. I wouldn't notice, my dear. You like a delicate flower. The Cindy Brady. I don't know. I, I don't. She is really excited. She tends to be, her character tends to be kind of the mastermind in our games. It would be nice to be a mastermind, I guess. Why does she have to be like a daddy girl? What does that keep happening? Ooh, Catwoman's going to slide off again. Look uh -oh. at her fuzzy though. Look at her fuzzy. Unbelievable how she's doing in this race. Oh, Sherry predicted Catwoman was going to tumble and she did. She went right on top of Winnie! Wow. The green token. She's... Oh, there goes Ruth. She's... Oh, there goes Ruth. And she's, she's at the back of the coin pusher. What an amazing move by this coin pusher beauty knowing to jump to the back of the pack to win the race. Let's see if she's successful. This is crazy. You better keep an eye on the loot camp. Make sure nobody's hopping out. Nobody has entered it as yet. Oh no, I'm all tangled up in my own fingers here. Oh. Wow. You can't even see anybody but Ruth. Wow. And a lot of other sidelines watching. It is. Now if you guess. Blue, of course, you were wrong. You were so wrong. Totally you were the wrong. wrongest of the wrongs. More wrong than I've ever been. So totally wrong. Would you agree with that? More wrong than I've ever been? Oh, you've been pretty wrong, but that was really wrong. Oh, I see Cindy I hope you're breaking across. I, hope you're I am. Of course I am. Across. Cindy Brady is hanging off the edge right now. Oh, there goes Cindy. So oh, if Cindy. you guessed yellow, you were wrong. Not as wrong as the folks who guessed blue, but you were pretty darn wrong. Cindy's in fifth place. Uhura's in sixth place. Oh, Ruth oh just she couldn't went wait down any on the play field. This game isn't over till the lunch lady sings. Does she wear a hairnet? Does the character work at the lunch lady? I always remember her being on a perk that screen harassed for Jersey Man. Okay, let me see what I can do here. The picture of Ruth Buzzy kind of reminds me of I see my, Winifred moving forward. Of your what? Of my elementary school lunch lady, Mrs. Fox who every Christmas would make a gingerbread boy and have the kindergartners play find a gingerbread man in school. And the kindergartners had to go to all the classrooms and look for the gingerbread boy who jumped out of the oven and ran away to hide. Well, that was a lot of fun. Mrs. Fox was awesome. What a great game to play when you're for a bunch of kindergartners. Come on, wouldn't that be a blast? Oh, sure. Find the gingerbread boy in the school. Plus, I just like baking gingerbreads. Well, you do. You do have the best gingerbread recipe. But we are here at a beauty pageant. I don't know which of these oh, ladies... we have a lot of coins here standing on edge. We do. I don't know if any of these ladies have cooking as their talent. Why aren't you playing a card? It was. He wasn't playing a card. I did. Look at the quarter card. It fell one, two, three. across, across, across. This coin slot doesn't go all the way to the edges. I try to get it as across as I can possibly do. Now 
We got four ladies left. Oh, I see Winnie and Catwoman are neck and neck over here. You see they are right, they're, they're right here under this on a return slot. Okay, so we we need we probably need to run through the talent competition here. We know that the Ruth Fuzzy character wears a hairnet. What does that have to do with the talent? I've she might be a really, cook. I've really seen her pummel some folks oh. with a purse. So, so purse uh, pummeling? Purse pummeling. Okay. Okay. Angry but mom. I'll tell you, it's so clear what Ruth Buggy would do. Her talent is comedy. It is. She's hilarious. Well, comedy and apparently purse pummeling. And Catwoman... She's really good. Although, she did get the cotton off the one. She did. That third Batman. Oh, Batman is pretty persistent. Yes, but she had him wrapped around her little claw. A claw? Yeah. That's the word I was trying to think. Okay, Ruth is breaking away on her own, breaking on the middle. So who we got to break? Is still make a break for yeah, Angry Mom, I think, is really doing well. I think Angry Mom is like in last place, which is her place in this instance. That's crazy. It's possible. There's a big push. Wow, a lot of that one is right over there. Okay. Well, I don't see angry mom anywhere. Maybe she, maybe she got got a cell phone call and had to go deal with some children. Yeah, I don't children. see her at all. I see Winnie and Catwoman are creeping out ooh, over here where I'm pointing. So perhaps parenting would be a talent for angry mom. Oh, if you could manage the children that she has and her partner. Oh my goodness. And keep such an amazing hairdo. Does. She doesn't have a pretty gray in her hair. It's still. Oh, she's probably coming right back. Oh, no. With her kids, that would turn anyone's hair. She's a natural oh, redhead. Yeah, but that doesn't mean that it didn't turn gray. Dear, I was a natural redhead. So, we did, we've done. I guess the last remaining talent would be Winifred Sanderson. Well, she can who's pass. quite magical. She she do a hypnosis. Yeah. A hypnotism act. Oh, speaking of hypnotizing, she is not here. She is not here. Let's see. Let's see if she can make us think she's not exiting the point with her. No. Both to pick three and are hoping she's not there. They're wanting us not to notice that she's there, aren't you? And somewhere in this mess, Angry Mom is hiding out. I'm sure she hasn't fallen into the loop cam, right? Maybe she's having a conversation with the judges about fair judging. Or some school officials. Maybe she thinks that purse pummeling should not be allowed. True. Because it's violent. Hmm. She could be trying to get I think she's a real control person. She tries to maintain control. That's why she looks so stressed out all the time in the crazy world. So I'm thinking she might be, maybe she does more zombie act. Where she pulled some crazy origami. I don't know. What would you do if you were angry mom? If I was angry mom, I'd get up on stage and start yelling at the judges and tell them that they're doing it wrong and making them feel like, oh, there goes Winifred. Winnie's down. Winnie's down. down. Oh, I see angry mom. She's oh, right no. here. Oh, she's right here. She's the ladies have clustered. 
Look at Ruth Fuzzy. Ruth Fuzzy, by being in last place, is actually fourth place. This is amazing. Go, Ruth. There's Winnie. Winnie is now in fourth place. Is she? And we've got Angry oh, yeah. Mom and Catwoman. She's in fourth place? Oh yeah, fourth place. So who will be third? Angry Mom or Catwoman? Catwoman is now so third backwards. place. Angry Mom outfoxed Catwoman. And Catwoman is now third place. And it would take a miracle of Ruth Buzzy, remarkably has totally flummoxed the judges. Her character is so different than everybody else. <laughs> she got points for being she's cool. She's kicking butt taking names, man. Oh, she's, sending a, she's sending angry mom back in the chain. And I'm gonna tell you, angry mom is a tough character. She just gives you a look. Holy smokes. Okay, John. Any moment now. And your mom's going to come across. running away from the purse pummeler. You have to watch John because he's a big cheater. I am not a cheater. He doesn't play across. I've been playing across the whole time. I've been watching where my court is called. Don't accuse me of cheating. you got to back it up with you. And Angry Mom is out! There she goes, ladies and gentlemen, have... second place, Angry Mom. All right, if you chose blue, you were wrong. So you wrong. You were so wrong. You were so wrong. More wrong oh, than anybody. Man. I can't believe it. Why did you pick blue? Not even close. This, this camera? There's Cindy uh, Brady. Cindy Brady was next. If you picked Cindy Brady, you were wrong. Not as wrong as the blue people, but you were really wrong. Sorry, if you Mom. chose woo, green, you were wrong too. Uh, not no. as wrong as the yellows, no, not sir. nearly as wrong nope, as the nope, blues, nope. but green mm -hmm. was wrong. And black, if you picked black, you were close. Yeah, but close only counts in horseshoes and hand grenades. Not close enough. You did not win. You were wrong. And oh, oh so close with so Angry close. Mom. Red did not win. You were two Orange. inches wrong. Orange is the winner by a good four fingers worth of length here. Oh, baby. Ruth Buzzy has totally blown the doors off of all the competition. Wow. Rocked it. Wow. Wow, who'd have thought? Celebration! Wow! Congratulations to all the people who picked orange because you are entered in tomorrow's drawing for mystery bag and it's right over here, this mystery bag. So congratulations, see you tomorrow. Do not have to be present to win, but face it, it's more fun if you are. So be the reason someone smiles today be safe, be healthy, and we'll see you next time. Bye.